City of Sioux City tonight about yesterday's discharge of untreated wastewater into the Missouri River. Now we knew from the Iowa DNR that around 2 million gallons discharged due to a malfunction at the Floyd lift station Wednesday morning. The city determined the issue was at the station after noticing issues with the flows into the wastewater treatment plant. They then investigated the Floyd lift station and found the issue. It was determined that a computer that runs the pumps had faulted out. So the pumps stopped pumping. So a lift station is just a wet well, it's collecting sewage, and then the pumps, there's floats in there, and then the pumps, those floats tell the pumps to kick on. And so the pumps went down. So basically that wet well was filling up with water, it uh, backed up into the pipes, and ultimately then ended up in the Bacon Creek Channel. While well, the initial estimate was that 2 million gallons of untreated wastewater had leaked into the channel and then flowed into the Missouri River, Baker says city staff now believes the amount was actually less than 500,000 gallons. Yeah, the Missouri River is so vast that it would it, the dilution factor would be not a significant concern to the public. And the little bit amount that would have gotten in there, it, it would have been treated in the Missouri. While there is still some of the discharge wastewater remaining in the Bacon Creek Channel, the city says it will need to bring in heavy machinery to clean it up, along with debris remaining in the channel from June's flooding.